Don't throw away your orange peel. Let's make this delicious drink instead. Orange cello with a salty citrus rim. I just bought six oranges for $25. Now that's a lot of money to spend on a fruit, I'll be honest with you, but this is not your average orange. It's a sumo orange, a fruit originating from Japan. It's sweet, it's plump, it's like an oversized mandarin. Absolutely delicious. I saw these for the first time last year when I moved to the US. I couldn't get myself to buy one because they were so pricey, but here we are a year later finally trying them. And now I get the hype. They are indeed very tasty, probably top three best oranges I've ever had. My first thought after after buying these was I can't waste an ounce of these. I just bought $10 worth of orange peels, so you better believe they're not gonna end in my compost bin. And in the midst of filming this video, I've realized I am indeed my parents' daughter. My mother and father grew up under a dictatorship, and during that time, every single basic ingredient like milk, flour, or oil was rationed per capita. You couldn't just go to a store, fill up your cart, and buy a bunch of stuff. Back then, you would go to a store and wait in line for hours. I'm talking four, five, six hours for them to assign you your rationed food. And you wouldn't have a guarantee that you would actually get your food by the time the five, six hour line would be over. Sometimes you would get your turn just to find out there's no more food left and you would go back home empty-handed. Now during the winter season, beside the very basic flour, sugar, and oil, you would get a very special ingredient available. And that very special ingredient was oranges. And both my parents and many other adults raised during that time could tell you they used to eat the whole thing. And I'm talking rind, pith, fruit, the whole thing. They would just eat it like an apple. It was such a special thing you couldn't waste any of it. And ever since I was little, my parents would never miss a chance to tell me that story every time I would open an orange in front of them. And though my parents eventually stopped eating oranges like apples, they never stopped saving the peels. They would dry the orange peels over the radiator and all those essential natural oils in the orange would disperse in the air and scent your room like nothing else. And that was my story for you folks. Now every time you'll see me eat an orange, you'll know what I'm thinking about. I hope you enjoy this recipe and I hope it gives you some ideas on how to make the most out of your citrus this season. And by the way, I know serving arancello with the salt rim isn't the most traditional thing I could have done, but the salt just balances out all the sweetness in the drink. It's actually perfect. Cheers.